Heather and AB here, and we are in a brand new pack, Sky Capsule, and uh, yeah, let's just jump right into it. So let's see, seeds can be obtained in the normal Minecraft way, harvesting grass. To grow grass, right-click bone meal on a grass block and break with your hand. If you accidentally break all the existing grass blocks before getting seeds, you can use the emergency items in the quest book. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, we already know about that. We are on a multiplayer server right now, our Patreon server. <clears throat> Be careful when you ultimine that you do not mine out your platform accidentally. You can also change the shape. Okay. Uh, let's actually go and do this. Let's find it here. Uh, this one, we are going to change it to five on my mouse. There we go. Uh, if you're having trouble getting water into a barrel from rain, you can create a crucible, put it over a heat source, put a bio resource in it. Okay, yep, we already know that. <coughs> if you're playing on Windows, this may trigger sticky keys. Okay, yeah. We already have that turned off. Um... We've included Project E in the pack to make things easier. Be aware that EMC values have been modified or removed on a lot of blocks. Okay. Uh, most everything from Tier 3 and Dimensional Resource have had their EMCs removed. Okay. <laughs> um, let's see. This is not an expert pack. Okay. But there are some recipe changes. Uh, you can search for items, view recipes. Oh, this is JEI. Okay. All right, well, we got that chapter done. <laughs> that was just the useful information optional one. There are chapter rewards as well. I guess when you finish the other chapters, these will open up and give you rewards. So that's pretty cool. Um, I'm thinking we're going to do our journey begins first. So let's close all these other ones and we will just work on this one. All right, so don't forget to set your home slash set home and chat will set your home. That is a great idea. Let's do that. Let's just put it right here. Set home. All right. Punch a tree, hammer, cobble, gravel, sand, dust. Uh, craft a tinker's melter. Don't worry, even though X and Helio isn't in the pack, you is in the pack. You won't be doing any seeding. Your main forms of resource generation will be custom resource capsules, EMC through Project E, resourceful bees, and mystical agriculture. Okay, so, and they gave us a transmutation table right off the bat. Cool. All right, so let's, uh, let's break down this tree. All right, and we can actually... Vein mine this. Okay, whew. I was like, oh, please tell me. Let's uh, do this so that we know our saplings. All right. So now we can have more saplings just in case. And this said it had. Whoop. <laughs> yes, yes, it does. All right. There we go, and honestly, in between, I will just keep chopping down trees to fill this up. There we go. Let's take out one of these to make a crafting table. Aww. It does have tinkers, but I think... To do the crafting station, I'm going to need a pattern, which is fine. I do have sticks. I do have wood. Let's turn this into planks and learn the planks. All right. Oh, just throwing everything we can into the table. Prefer crafting stations. 
who just look nicer to me. Oh, that was a task. Okay. <laughs> it must be somewhere in here. All right. So we are going on an adventure. All right. So uh, I guess the next thing we need is cobble. Simply break the four polished andesite blocks next to the water and then the one holding the lava above and cobblestone should begin generating. All right. So let's do this. We shall make a wooden pickaxe here. Um, let's learn that. All right, so if I break this, if I break this, and this one, and that one, and oh, that one got burned up. That's okay. So let's put those there, and there we go. And then we should be able to vein mine this. All right. Which is very, aw. I was gonna say it's very nice until it goes into the lava. Then it's not very nice. Then it's, then it's sad. Stop going in the lava. Alright, I forgot to do this real quick. Oh, it is off. Oh, it's because it's a step down. Because these are slabs. Okay. I was like, oh, it's kind of annoying. I mean, it makes sense. Alright. There is our 64, and that gives us 64 stone. All right. Um, and then I'm supposed to break it down into sand, gravel, and dust. So let's see about a hammer. Let's see here. Um, I think it's just going to be one of these, right? I, um, I think I'm going to make a stone one, though. All right, so do a little bit of that. Oh, let's see. All right, and there's the gravel. All right, and then let's actually put this here for the sand. And then another one for the dust. All right, now I think I need, oh, I need 27. Okay, I need 27 of each. So let's actually, let's, let's, let's do this. I don't want to use the table for all of the stuff. Cause it's, that just seems cheaty to me. All right, all right, I am under the water there. Ugh, okay. I hate that the water pushes me back. Now, I'm fighting with the lava here. All right, so there's that. Let's do, let's actually break this real quick. Actually, you know what? I don't want to put down the things on... On the grass, because I don't want the grass to go away. So, we're going to do this. We're going to make a little, little area over here. Actually, let's do this as well. There we go. We learned torches, so now we can light this up. Okay. All right. 
right. There we go. There's our sand. Now let's make this into dust. All the fun of starting on a sky block. All right, here we go. There we go. All right. Oh, the slabs are not EMC. Oh, is the hammer? It is. Okay. I'm not that great at remembering to put things in the table because I don't usually use the table. So. <laughs> All right. Let me do this. That gives us more. All right. Compressed grout can be can be melted in a tinker smeltery. All right. Oh, and that that would give us only a total of ten compressed grout. You'll need five glass for the melter. Okay, so let's do this. Let's make a furnace. All right, and then we will cook this up here. We'll make a charcoal. All right, we'll put the charcoal in there. We'll put these back in here because we don't we don't need those. All right, so let's cook up the sand. Um, while we wait on that, let's get this guy going. Oh, there we go. I guess I should have made an axe, but okay, it's fine. Thankfully, we can punch it with our fist and still get, ooh, apples. <laughs> I was going to say wood, but apples are great too. All right. So there's that. Let's learn it. And I think we need one more because I think it said it, we needed five. Yes. All right. Smelt dirt in a furnace. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know if there's anything under here. So let's try to do this. Ha ha ha. <laughs> I did it. All right. All right. So now let's grab sub dirt and see what it wants us to do do with it here. Alright, so there's our five glass. Uh, 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 look at the dirt quest. Oh, this one. Alright. When she oh okay so we're supposed to uh, can easily automated with wooden hoppers early game. Oh okay, it wanted us to uh, do the barrels. I think. <laughs> I think we kind of outsmarted the game a little bit here. Oh wow. Okay, so those seared bricks are just dirt. All right, that's cool. All right, so we need 27 of them. So let's let's just take the 27 it wants. There we go. That gives us more dirt and more bread. 
So I think it's wanting us to make the smeltery stuff now. All right, so this is what we needed the glass for. So we need five glass and four seared brick. And that gives us the seared ingot gauge. Let's learn it. And then we will use it. For the seared melter. And then we need the seared table. Um, gotta remember to put everything in there to learn it. Alright, and then last is the heater itself. There we go. Now let's see, where should we put this one? I'm thinking, let's, let's come, kind of come over this way. Just for the time being. Let me see, um... I don't know that I have an idea of what I want to, uh, how I want our island to look. I'll have to come up with some ideas, but we're going to put it right here. So the heater goes on the bottom and then the tank. All right. Let's grab some charcoal here. All right, now let's see. Compressed is all of the compressed. Okay, so. <clears throat> Two and three. So let's compress the sand. Compress the gravel and compress the dust. These also have EMC, so we are going to throw them in here. All right. Dust, gravel, sand. Dust on top, gravel in the middle, sand on the bottom. All right, so it says we're going to need a total of 10. It gave us four, so we need six more. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so here's the total of 10. Craft your first mini resource fragment tier one can be placed in tier one resource generator. Only one is needed per machine. The fragment is not consumed. All right. So molten grout. I'm not quite sure. Let's see. Pour from the smeltery on an empty casting table. Okay. So. Oh, that's why we need a 10, because it needs... Okay, okay, I gotcha. Because it needs 10. Alright. So there's our molten grout. We'll have one paint. Okay, so let's pour it onto the empty casting table. And we'll watch as it... <laughs> okay. And this has EMC as well. Oh no, it's raining. All right, can be placed in a tier one resource generator. All right, so that's this one. Advancement, tier one resource generator. This will be your first foray into resource automation. The quest for all the custom machines doesn't play nice with Feed the Beast quest, so the icon in each of the custom machine quests may show as a partially completed. Okay. 
All right, so we need cobblestone, dirt, compressed cobblestone. Okay, so let's actually, let me see something. Wood is 32, cobble is one. So let's do this real quick. I'm actually going to make a chest here. Let's do this, and then we'll, we'll switch it to the other one to have that one as well. Ugh, I don't like ha not having room. I'm just going to stick the stuff that doesn't have EMC in this chest over here. Alright, let's do this. I am going to make a stone pickaxe now. And I will sit here and get cobble. I will get trees just to boost the EMC. And we are actually at the end of the episode. So if you guys liked it, hit the like button. Questions and comments go down below in the comment section. If you're new to the channel, hit the like and subscribe so that you know when I have new content coming out. Check out all the links down below, including the host havoc where you can get your own Minecraft server or join our Patreon and you can play on here with me as well. I know that there's quite a few people playing it. Uh, it's super early in the morning right now, so they're not on at this moment, but they have been enjoying it and uh, you can as well. So come hang out, be a cupcake Patreon. And, uh, yeah, until the next episode, I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.